The environment of coastal Louisiana is prime habitat for giant salvinia, one of the most invasive aquatic weeds in the world. When it forms dense mats like this one, it can have devastating effects. Giant salvinia completely blocks out the light and effectively it kills off all of the submerged aquatic vegetation and that depletes the oxygen levels in the water so that can lead to fish kills, invertebrate kills and things like that. The weed can quickly inundate an area. Salvinia can double its size in about 36 hours, so it is an exponential uh, grower. Salvinia is being controlled through three methods. One is using herbicides, a second is physical removal, the third is a biological control method using a weevil that causes the plant to eventually die off. Typically the damage starts off presenting itself looking like uh, the yellowing that you see and then it starts to turn brown and eventually it'll turn black. And once it turns black, that's when it sinks down to the bottom. The weevils have proven effective in controlling salvinia, but how long it takes to accomplish this may vary. We have seen complete control, meaning going from a thick uh, mat of giant salvinia to open water in about four months. However, in some instances too, it can take about a year or so for weevil populations to get established. Shackelford says when plants begin to yellow and turn brown due from damage caused by the weevil, he recommends moving some of the damaged salvinia to greener areas to help disperse the weevils. With the LSU Ag Center, this is Craig Gotro reporting.